Raw kicks off with Randy Orton and he calls out AJ Styles so he comes out and AJ brags about the RKO he did last week then Drew McIntyre comes out and says he wants to fight too so there's a triple threat match between the men and McIntyre wins with a Claymore kick on AJ Ricochet versus Mojo Rawley and Ricochet wins with the 630 Charlotte Flair versus Sarah Logan and Charlotte wins with the figure 8 Paul Heyman and Brock Lesnar come out and as Paul is talking the 24-7 champion R-Truth comes out and Truth announces he's entering the Royal Rumble then when he finds out Brock Lesnar's in the Rumble, he announces that he's withdrawing from the Rumble. Then Brock F5's Truth, and as Truth is going backstage, Mojo Rawley attacks him and pins him for the 24-7 title. Rusev vs Bobby Lashley with Lana in his corner. During the match, Liv Morgan comes out and Lana throws her into the barricade, then Lashley spears Rusev for the win. The Viking Raiders, Eric and Ivard vs the Singh brothers, Sunil and Samir Singh, and Eric and Ivard win with the Viking experience. Becky Lynch and Asuka have a contract signing for their women's title match at the Royal Rumble. After they both sign the contract, Asuka sprays green mist in Becky's face. Buddy Murphy vs Alistair Black, and Alistair wins with a black mass. Eric Rowan beats some jobber with a claw slam. The Big Show, Kevin Owens, and Samoa Joe vs Seth Rollins and the Kamen at Azad. They all brawl before the match, then take it to the ring for the match. It's no disqualification, and the match can only end when one team cannot continue, and there are no pinfalls or submissions. Kevin Owens runs up the stage and flips off of it. And Buddy Murphy is still sitting at ringside from his match, and he helps Rollins by low blowing the Big Show. And Seth's team wins after the Big Show isn't responding to a 4 on 1 beatdown. Then Rollins and Murphy hug. We'll see you next week for the next Rush Draw review.